here like that. Everybody, it's day five. This is the second video of day five, and in this video, I wanted to show you just a little bit about making the juice and the juicer and, and how I go about doing this. So, this is my Jack Lane juicer right here. This is about a hundred dollars, and I've had it for over 13 years. So, I highly recommend this uh, brand and this model. It's really powerful and it does everything that needs to be done. This is uh, my beaker that I put the juice in, which is actually a uh, French press coffee. So I'm not drinking any coffee during the fast, so I'm going to use this to fill all the juice up. It holds a lot of juice and made of glass, real easy to clean. So right now I'm going to make the cabbage patch drink. I'm going to put a little cabbage into our system. It's really good for you. And I'm just going to go through and, and show you how I do this. and and show you the end product, which is going to be a delicious, beautiful cabbage juice. Put it on, put the motor running, got the blade turning. So you want to start with um, the, the greens, leafy greens or anything like that. So in this juice is going to be the cabbage. Yeah, you push those through first and then um, you know follow that up with carrots, celery and apples. So we'll start with the cabbage. Kind of drop it in there. Push it down. Some of these are a little bit difficult to get through. That's why I'm showing you this video. How to work with that part. You get the cabbage in. Start getting that cabbage juice. Yum. And you just keep feeding it through there. Twist this part a little bit. Get it all the way down in. A little more cabbage. Now I'm going to follow that up with the celery. Fresh organic celery all washed up real well. You can put the whole stalk in there. All right, that's coming out real easily. There's a lot of water in the celery. As opposed to the cabbage. All right, it's looking really good. Nice and green. Looks a little bit like ectoplasma from Ghostbusters. So then we're going to follow that up with the apples. One whole apple. Kind of use a little elbow grease to get it on down in there. Alright, and I always like to finish with carrots, so what we have now left is a lemon and some carrots. So I'm just going to throw this whole, this is a tiny little lemon, so throw this whole thing in there. If it's a bigger lemon, then you can cut it in half. And once you get that going through, it smells incredible. Can you smell that? through the uh, video <laughs> and then you just finish up with the carrots I like to lift the cup up a little bit so you don't get carrot juice all over your clothes although in some circles carrot juice on your clothes can be quite attractive the last couple of carrots here That's 
it. You just let it kind of finish up. The juice keeps coming on out a little bit. A little trick I found is just to tilt it up. Get all that juice out. Kind of turn it off. All right. And then you just get it. Stir it up real nice. This one's got that nice carroty orange color. Pour it in our drinking glass there. Nice big juice. Keep you going all day. And there you have it. Cabbage patch. Nice, clean, organic, fresh juice. Ready to go into all your cells. Bon appetit. Ha, ha, ha.